All right, so a few great drills you can do as a beginner, starting out on the wall, hold on to something. And the first thing you do is literally just stand on the ice. Standing together will be a little bit tougher, a little bit wider base will be a little bit easier. From there, you can move to just doing marches, nice and slow, very carefully, almost like you're taking steps, still holding on to something. Then you can try to hold for a split second at the top. Again, just building the ankle, knee, and hip stability for yourself. From there, you can then move to the wall and just kind of practice scraping the ice back and forth, just shaving the top of it. This is kind of mimicking like what we would do when we're actually skating. So you can do this for a really long time. Actually, it's pretty good. And then you can get to a point where you're taking bigger ones where you go really out and push really hard and far to the point where you actually feel yourself kind of going into the boards a little bit. You can see holding on the whole time. From there, what I would do is to hold on and then start doing pushes off one leg where you're using that other leg to just guide you. Push it off, push it off, turn around, push off, push off, push off. And then from there, once you get comfortable, you can do push off with one leg, push off with the other leg, turn around, push off with one leg, push off with the other leg. When you're doing this, one of the big key things with the push off is to try to keep as much of a V as you can, especially with that initial one. You wanna be almost as close as you can to a 45 degree, maybe even a 90 degree angle to get really good push off. From there, once you've mastered all those, you can try to do them again off the wall, still close to the wall, um, and potentially holding on to one of those um, little pusher things if you need. It's a great way to start with ice skating, and then um, in no time, you'll be able to push off a little more without any help. Hopefully you enjoy.